Good evening. My name is Sudarshan, and uh, I'm very happy to introduce myself today because today I joined a membership or I have joined a Buddhism group called as SGI, and it was introduced by my friend Bartha Verma. So she is my mentor, and following the mentorship, I am her disciple. Okay, so why I have joined is a question, right? Everybody wants to know that why a person wants to join a Buddhism or why I have suddenly taken a decision to join Buddhism. Actually, it took lot of time. Like it was like three to four months of full of thoughts and everything in my mind going on with this religion and that religions and the various views aspects of those. religion and then finally it came today on 24th march 2018 i have decided to join sgi or also known as um sgi members let's see what is it you can search on the google um today's was my first day so i don't know much about it about the organization but yes i know about its principle about its philosophy about buddhism and buddhahood so that's the reason why i have joined the organization not with the name but with the impact they have created in ordinary people's life um the theme for today was blue deeper than indigo and blue deeper than indigo gives um, about if you dip a blue cloth yeah if you dip a blue cloth if i am correct if you dip a blue cloth or if you dip a cloth uh, the extract that we get it actually from the indigo plant so if we dip such kind of clothes inside the water it absorb more color right it absorb more color the more you wash it with the indigo or the more you wash it with the dye the more and more enhancement of color take place this idea symbolize that the more and more you learn about buddhism or of any religion actually it is not only about buddhism but if you learn more and more of any religion ponder on it think over it okay you will get inside the religion more more enlightenment reaching towards the enlightenment will be faster than before so this is what the um, not in a thought which is very small but it has a very big meaning um uh, next aspect was let me say uh, the next thing was about the mentor and disciple okay what as a mentor says and what is a disciple is mentor is the guru and the disciple is the follower okay now for me like uh, barkha is my mentor and uh, mentor surpasses the knowledge the knowledge that you get from your teacher from your mentor is itself is a disciple of buddha right so she is the disciple of buddha but for me she is a mentor so whatever knowledge she has attained within this course journey or within this life okay that knowledge will be passed to me or to other mentors or to other disciples so when she impart the knowledge of buddhism in me she has the faith she has the trust that today this disciple will be surpassing the mentor right that means that today whatever knowledge i will gain with my experience with that knowledge i will surpass the same thought of my mentor to my disciples okay so this is the like a journey you pass the knowledge from one generation to another generation from one person to another person in keeping the view of buddhism in mind so that was a thought actually i am a teacher and the teacher become a teacher it was a big is a big job right 
my physics teacher Ms. Bula, which I will never forget, she was my guru. She trusted me. She trusted. She was a Christian. She trusted me that today, whatever I am teaching to this boy in physics, no matter whether he fails within this course of journey, that is in 12th class, 11th class, though he failed with the subject, but she was having the faith. She was having the faith that I will have a uh, very good marks actually yeah i'll get very good marks in physics like past 11th 12th it was very tough i did not get very good marks but that last moment she had the faith when i was entering inside the board room for writing the examination of 12th class she had the faith and she said that sudarshan two years of my hard work and my faith or trust in you or with my knowledge the trust that i have in my knowledge i have imparted on you and i will i know that you will excel in your exams and that has created a magic you know um, 12th class i wrote the examination i was not sure anything about it and when the result was announced i was the third ranker or the third topper in physics with a by pc without mathematics background so that's the faith that's the miracle the faith of my teacher on me was a magic so when today is the new sudarshan and the new beginning of the sudarshan i have joined this group of sgi okay and after a month i will share you something which is brilliant or something that changed my life uh, for example now at present i am running with a tuition we have only few members let's hope that namyo ho renge kyo the thought or the mantra a guru mantra of buddhism namyo ho renge kyo works like miracle in my life and for the next session i will be there with you sharing my views and sharing my ideas take care bye good evening